All right, so good morning, good afternoon, everyone. Um, thank you for joining our Zeek monthly community call. And um, so we don't have very many people today in the room. So I'll just go ahead and ask Christian if he wants to share any updates on the Zeek open source project side of things. Yeah, sure. I can give a quick update. Thank you, Fatima. So let's see. Um, I think the biggie right now is that two patch releases are out. Tim put those together this week. These are 606 and 701. Uh, both contain bug fixes, no security fixes. The 606 one is really small. Uh, it contains an HTTP fix. We had a, a, a bug in how we reported HTTP passwords, which was kind of interesting, which if they included a colon, we would not report the complete thing. This was a uh, community contribution. So thank you very much for that. This is also in the 701 release. Um, and that one, in addition, contains more fixes, including particularly backports for LDAP improvements that we thought are uh, valuable to backport because they've helped some people keep memory under control in, in some settings. Um, other than that, basically 7.1 development is in flight at this point. We have sort of some some biggies going on there. If you saw the, uh, the webinar I gave the other day, then I sketched that a little bit there. But it's essentially a first version of the storage framework that Tim is working on um, and uh, extensive prototyping that will hopefully lead to a uh, first version quite soon that Arne is doing for making our um, cluster backend technology pluggable. So basically, like the idea being that our own broker middleware is no longer the only middleware we can use in Zeek, um, but we can open it up to more common broker style uh, message IO software. Um, so that's uh, ongoing and in flight. Um, we are planning to have 7.1 sort of come out at some point around November. So that's still somewhat like a ways away, but not super far. Um, we'll see how well we can keep sort of, you know, uh, sight of that, but that should be roughly when that comes out. And if it does and when it does, um, that will be the time at which we stop supporting the 6.0 LTS series as usual. So the dot one always means that we stop supporting the previous LTS cycle, I, I think, as most of you know. Um, but, you know, like we'll, we'll make sure to remind everybody when that time comes closer. Um, I think that's most of what we have right now. It looks like we'll pre presenting at um, hack.lu in Luxembourg next month. That is exciting. That is hot off the presses. That just came in. Um, so we'll make sure to announce you know, that more in more detail to you guys when we have stuff up about that. Um, I think that's all I have, Fatima. Thank you very much at this point. Cool. Thanks, Christian. Are yes. there any questions for Christian? Mm -hmm. All right. Um, so if not, then I can just go ahead and give a quick update on the training side and a couple more updates on what we are doing on the Zeek webinar site and upcoming events that you should keep an eye on if you would like to learn more about Zeek. So um, for the September, we have two more webinars coming up. So the next one would be on 16th of September. And that will be the same time as our community call. And the presenter would be Justin, and he'll be presenting on the don't be sad, make sure your input traffic is um, in good health. So that is on 18 September, 10 a.m. Pacific time. And then following that webinar, we have one more webinar coming up on 25th of September. And um, Aaron from NERSC is going to present in that um, webinar on how to visualize the ODICS networks for security. And with that, they, th those two will be our September web webinars coming up. And our next meeting that we, that's going to happen in October 1st, first Wednesday of October, our Z community, community call, that is again, it, that will again be a webinar. So that is the third webinar. So next month, we might not have our regular um, community call, but it will be a webinar uh, as well. And I can give you the details of that webinar real quick. So in, it's on 2nd of October and, um, Let's see. Again, Aaron is going to present on that one as well. And it says how Zeek helps secure open science networks. So with the with that, um, I think the next piece of update is we are going to be presenting our Zeek training, the, 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 the one day training, one day long training that we present every year. 
Um, so this year it's going to be at NSF, again, NSF Summit that is happening in Pittsburgh. Uh, it's the first week or second week of October from 7th October. So our training, the Zeke training is going to be on the 7th of October, which is Monday. There will be two tracks. One will be the introduction to Zeke or how to uh, do Zeke clusterization introduction. And the parallel training will be run by Ashish on um, Zeke, Zeke scripting, uh, hands-on Zeke scripting. They both will be offered at NSF Summit and the registrations for NF NSF Summit is going to close on 20, 20th of September. So you still have a couple of weeks to get registered, make sure you select the correct training that you want to attend. So that's going to happen next month. Again, the hotel the hotel block cutoff date is coming up. It's like 9th of September. So like by the, by the end of this week, registration is open till 20th of September for NSF Summit. So if you guys are interested in attend attending Zeke training, it's again, it's only in person. So it will not be um, live streamed. So if you guys are interested in coming up in person and attending the Zeke training and just interact with um, folks there, then keep an eye on the NSF registration deadline and make sure you register for the correct event. With that, I think that's pretty much all I have on the Zeke training and the community webinars update side. Um, other than that, I don't think so. I have anything else. So if people have questions, comments, or if, you, if people would like to share some kind of fun Zeke stories, then we are open and all ears for that. Okay, so it looks like we have a pretty quiet crowd today. So cool. With that, I think we can adjourn and you guys have a wonderful rest of the day and have a nice coming up weekend. So take care, guys, and I'll see you guys in what in two weeks, 18 September, next um, Zeke webinar. Thanks All for right. joining us. Thanks Bye. for joining. Take care.